Good morning and welcome to day one of the 2012-2013 school year. I'm Michael alongside Thomas and we have a lot planned for today but we'll start with some crucial announcements that you may want to hear. Thomas? Yeah Michael there's certainly a lot to go over this morning and we start with an announcement from the College and Career Center. There are lots of great colleges that you may be interested in coming to visit Monticello this fall. Dickinson College will be here on Monday at 105. You can sign up outside of the College Career Center in P105. Remember, you must sign up and receive permission from your teacher at least 24 hours in advance. Mentorship will continue throughout this week and next. Please report to your mentorship class until August 31st. Tell your parents, back to school night will take place September 6th at 6, and that's all I have. Michael? Okay, so now as many of you have already noticed, there are a lot of new faces here at Monticello, and one of our goals this year is to introduce you to a few of those new people every day so that you can get to know exactly who's who at Monticello. Today, meet your administrators. Hello, I'm Mr. Bonham. I am a new assistant principal here at Monticello High School. Excited to be here. I uh, am in G111, so if you have any, uh, any questions or issues or concerns, feel free to come on down and be happy to, to sit down and have a conversation. I am Mr. Atkins, and I'll be working with the 10th grade students this year. I will work with science, social studies, fine arts, and health and PE. Hi, I am Dr. Beth Costa, and I am in Red 211. This is where you can find me on some days. I hope to be out and about. I'm working with ninth graders in particular, and I am so happy to be a Mustang. Hi, Mustangs. This is Dr. Turner, welcoming you back to school. And for ninth graders, welcome you to Monticello High School. Uh, you can find me in the main office and roaming around the building. Uh, I look forward to seeing you all. Welcome back, and I hope you all have a great school year. So welcome back. I'm down in the library with our excellent librarians. There's lots of great stuff going on in the library, and I'm going to let them tell you a little more about the various things they offer. Ms. Ackroyd, what's new in the library this year? Boy, we've got a lot of new things. Still everything you loved from last year, but some new things. This is the first, not Me, a new I'm thing, new. a person. Ms. Craddock is our new librarian down here. She will live all over the place. like. Ms. Ms. haber Meyer and I do, but she will be at the reference desk, so the reference desk is new. You can That's, refer to me anytime. Yes, you can refer to her. Um, another new thing is, um, I'm trying to think, we have labeling at the circulation desk. Um, the signs uh, are really cute. Yeah, and you know what, you guys have been wonderful and been down here and taken ownership of this library. This is your space. We can't keep you out. We try sometimes, but we can't. Um, but we're trying to get the teachers to buy into this place too. So the teacher workroom is now really a teacher workroom. But you can't go there. No, you can't go there. I'm sorry you can't go there. Um, the whiteboard room now, we tried this last year, it didn't work out too well, but maybe better this year. The whiteboard room is really a quiet study room. Shh, yes, you will have to do work in there. Um, Ms. Craddock, can you think of anything else that's new and improved since you've come on board in the library? No, I don't think so. I'm fairly boring, but we'll have some new stuff rolling out in October or November. So look for updates later. And you can see one thing. You want to go ahead and take it, Ms. Haberman? And don't forget your orange pass. If you want to come to the library, please bring your pass. And don't forget to check out books. And so what are the rules during Mustang morning? Are, is it come and go as you please? Do you have to have a pass? How does that work? Um, from our understanding how Mustang Morning is going to work, everybody's going to report to mentorship. And in mentorship, you will get your Mustang Morning assignment. However, if you don't have a Mustang Morning assignment, you can ask your mentorship teacher to give you a pass to the Media Center. And we'll be down here welcoming you as always. That's my favorite part of the day, I think, is Mustang Morning, wouldn't you say? Yes. So I don't know yet. I haven't done one. Yes, she'll see. I'll let you know in the updates in November. But we will find out. As we find out more information and see how this new procedure with mentorship and Mustang Morning rolls out, then we'll know better the procedures that we'll have down here. Great. Well, thank you. And sports is up next. Stay tuned. Everybody here. Everybody here. Let's get into it. Get stomping. Get it started. Get it started. Get it started. Let's get it started. Let's get it started in here. Let's get it started. Let's get it started in here. Let's get it started. Let's get it started in here. Let's get it started. 
Good morning, Mustang fans. I'm Lauren, here to give you the Monticello Sports Report. Unfortunately, last night the field hockey team lost 4-0 against Cortland here in the Mustang Stadium. The golf team season has been well underway as they played matches as early as August 2nd. They will travel to Tanyard Golf Club to take on Louisa County tomorrow at 4. Monticello will play its first football game next Friday when the team travels across town to take on the Albemarle Patriots. If you are interested in playing softball in the spring, please check in with Coach Craddock in B201 regarding important meeting dates and off-season conditioning information. That's all there is for sports. Now let's head back over to Michael and Thomas at the news desk. Thanks, Lauren. Finally on Monticello today, our new principal, Dr. Turner, would like to personally welcome you to the 2012-2013 school year. Good morning, staff and students. This is Dr. Turner. I would like to welcome you all back to Monticello High School. I am extremely excited about what we're going to do this year, and I'm also excited that you all are back. I hope that your summer break was relaxing and fun, and um, I wanted to make sure that I let you all know that the staff, faculty, administration, we are all planning to have a wonderful year. Uh, we've been working hard the last couple of weeks to get ready for you and to make sure that we are providing you with the world-class education. Um, I want to tell you a little bit about the first week or so of school. Uh, the first eight days of school, you will have your mentorship class, and during that time, we will have class meetings, and the admin team will go uh, into uh, in more detail the uh, specifics for this year in regards to some of the expectations and opportunities that are associated with being a student here at Monticello High School. Um, again, I would like to welcome you all. Uh, we, are, we are looking forward to a wonderful school year, and I am excited to have you all back, and I want you to have a great, not only a great day, but a great school year. Thank you. And that wraps up today's edition of Monticello Today. We'll see you tomorrow. Have a great first day of school. Check us out on Twitter at MHS underscore TV.